मेरा नाम अर्जुन है मेरा कुछ टाइम पहले के दिन ट्रांसप्लांट हुआ था उसके बाद मैंने एक एंटी रिजेक्शन मेडिसिन लेता हूँ और मुझे पूछना यह है कि उससे कोई कैंसर या इन्फेक्शन हो सकता है अगर ऐसा है तो मुझे क्या करना चाहिए ओके अर्जुन दैट्स अ वेरी गुड क्वेश्चन किडनी ट्रांसप्लांट के बाद यू एक्चुअली हैव टू टेक इम्यूनो सप्रेसिव मेडिकेशन लाइफ लॉन्ग इफ यू स्टॉप दीज मेडिकेशन देर विल बी अ रिजेक्शन एंड लॉस ऑफ किडनी सो एवरीथिंग हैज रिस्क एंड बेनिफिट्स द बेनिफिट इज दैट द किडनी इज वर्किंग द रिस्क इज दैट येस यू आर प्रोन फॉर इन्फेक्शंस सो यू नीड टू प्रोटेक्ट योर सेल्फ it starts with hand hygiene self hygiene third it starts with uh, you know not to interact with people who have infections sore throat cold cough and then not to go into crowded places and this is especially the first 6 months where you have uh, had induction agents atg injections etc the body is uh prone for infection so you need to protect yourself so cook food at home and eat hot cooked food so that you don't develop a diarrhea from outside food and yes there is a small possibility of developing cancer not everybody so that is the reason you know beyond 6 months there should be regular follow up you need to follow up with your local nephrologist or doctor or physician or surgeon who is taking care of you and uh, so that they'll do test on you and by that they can pick up if there is any new cancer which is coming up very important to all the kidney transplant patients out there look for new spots on your body black spots red spots if they are there please show it to your doctor second if you find fresh lumps in your under your skin new formed nodules in the skin please and show them to your doctor because those need to be tested it could be fungus or it could be some cancer so that is the reason why a close follow up post post transplant is essential